it smells like a hippie but not like a terrible hippie you know gonna love you honey on and on and on i'm a morning dove singing out a song hey guys it's danielle with danielle gets it done and today i am sharing my haul of the young living premium starter kit with you. I'm so excited. I got this about a week ago, so I've been playing around with the oils a little bit so I can give you my initial reactions. This is in collaboration with my good friend, Sarah from the Mama Lounge. She's a Young Living rep and actually helped me make this purchase. So when you're done watching this, head over to her channel she is unboxing one of her monthly shipments from Young Living. I can't wait to see what she got. Uh, if you're not familiar with her, you're gonna love her. Be sure to subscribe and send her some love. Stay tuned to the end of the video because I'm doing a giveaway of one of these oils to one of you. Can't wait. I am not an expert in essential oils by any stretch of the imagination, but I do love them. I've been using them for about three years and I ran out of about three of my most used bottles at the same time. And I've also been wanting to add a diffuser to my house. So I reached out to Sarah because I heard about this kit, Young Living Cells, that gives you a really steep discount. So, and it comes with a diffuser. So it kind of made sense for my situation just to jump right in. The kit retails, like if I would have bought everything separately, it would have been over $300 and I paid either $160 or $165, so about 50% off. So now that I have the kit, I have these amazing oils in the diffuser at a really steep discount. I get discounts on other oils. I don't have to pay retail price and if I want to sell them I can receive a small commission so if you want to buy an oil if friends or family want to buy something from me I can help them out and make um, some change so if you want a steep discount or you want to become a love young living rep this is how you get started basically that being said, let's get into it. I am a sucker for packaging. Leave a comment below if you are too. You open it up and oh my word. Really quick before I get started, people get benefits from oils in three ways. First is just to smell them and this doesn't have to be expensive. You can literally smell the oil. I'm sure I'll be doing that a lot in this video and that will give you benefits. They're so calming. And your lungs are connected to your bloodstream, so they actually get into your body that way. You can put a little bit on a cotton ball and put that in front of your vent in your car. You can buy a diffuser. I'll show you mine in a couple minutes. Um, this is a diffuser necklace. I've had this in a lot of my videos. I've shown it before, but if I can get it open, There is a little cotton pad in here, and I put, I would say, two drops every couple days in here. And then I wear it around my neck and smell those oils all day long. Right now I have a drop of lemon and a drop of lavender. Love it. Um, secondly, you can apply it to your skin. You, It'll go through your pores directly into your bloodstream especially if it's your first time using an oil, you'll want to use a carrier oil to dilute it. A carrier oil is a fatty oil like olive oil, coconut oil, grapeseed oil. So some fatty oil, a couple drops of your essential oil, and then rub it into your skin. Do your research, especially if you have babies or children. These are natural, but that doesn't mean they're safe for everyone or every application. So do your research and then thirdly people ingest these oils they will put them a drop in a glass of water or tea they'll buy their own capsules and make their own vitamins almost i personally don't do that i just needed to do more research i don't feel comfortable doing that like i said these are strong <laughs> especially young living they are so natural and potent that they uh, one drop of peppermint oil is equivalent to 16 bags of peppermint tea. So 
it's just a lot. And so I need to do my research, you should do yours. The whole reason I just said that is you'll see this top row is a little different packaging than the bottom. This is Young Living's Vitality Blend. Young Living says it's safe to ingest for certain people, you know, not kids and babies. Uh, I use all my oils aromatherapy, don't think that's a word, and topically. I personally don't ingest. I just wanted to get that out there. So this comes right out, and you guys, the back has these little legs that come out, and you can make a stand to display your beautiful oils. I think that is so cool. I'm gonna quickly go through these and give you my initial thoughts. There are 10. The first is lemon. Oh, it, it's such a fresh smell. I diffuse this a lot, especially in the spring and summer. I mentioned I have a drop of this in this guy. It is a very uplifting smell, so it's really good for the mornings and I clean with this. I make my own all-purpose cleaner with vinegar and water and a few drops of lemon help boost the cleaning power and cuts through that vinegary smell. My husband can't stand my vinegar cleaner, so this really helps to help him calm down a little bit. Copaiba. Copaiba is new to me and oh my word it smells so good you guys it's very earthy and grounding oh i did a little research most essential oils are distilled from the plant so the leaf the stem this is distilled from the bark of a tree and so that's where it gets that earthy aroma I'm gonna be diffusing this a lot in my life, I can already tell, and it's supposed to help with pain and inflammation. I haven't used it for that yet, but I am obsessed with the smell. Next is Digize. This helps with digestion issues. Whoops. This helps with digestion issues, and it smells like Hippie Town, USA, not a fan. <laughs> Woo! Not a fan of the smell, but I did use it and it was helpful. I eat a mostly vegan diet and I indulged last week in a meal that was not vegan and so I didn't feel good because I'm not used to it. And I diluted some of this in a carrier oil and rubbed it on my abdomen and I did feel a lot better. Digize. Next is Thieves. Thieves is my second favorite all-time oil. If I only had to pick two oils, it would be lavender and Thieves. Let me know your go-to oils. Ugh. Thieves smells like Christmas in a bottle. I love the smell. I diffuse it a lot in the winter uh, in my diffuser and I'll put it in here in the winter a lot. And it really helps to ward off sickness. So I also use it a lot in cold and flu season. Topically, P.S. A great place to topically put oils is the bottom of one's feet with the carrier oil. Our pores on our feet are really large, so it seeps in easily. And I love the smell of thieves, but if you're not crazy about a smell of oil, uh, like I don't like digize, that'd be a good one to maybe put on the bottom of my feet because it's, you know, far away from my nose. But thieves is amazing. A really cool legend of how it got its name is. These thieves or grave robbers were robbing graves during the plague and the reason they were able to not get infected themselves, legend has it, is the blend of five spices that they carried around with them. So they bottled that up and now we have, oh, I love it. They also have a whole line of cleaning product called Thieves and I'll show you a little bit about that in a second. Peppermint. Here is my peppermint. I have not opened this yet because this is what I am going to be giving away to one of you. The rules will be in the description box below. Selfishly, I chose this one because I have a full bottle, so I don't really need this, but peppermint is another really uplifting aroma, good kind of in the morning. It's energizing. 
It's really good for headaches. I've gotten a lot of relief, so is my husband who suffers from migraines. Dilute it with the carrier oil, rub it on your temples. You should always be careful around your eyes, but especially with peppermint, it has that icy, icy hot effect. It's a, uh, if it's your first time using it, just use a drop, because you might be surprised, but this is awesome. Oh, I also use this in the bathroom. I deep clean our toilets once a week, but sometimes midweek I'll just put one drop in the bowl of the toilet and it kind of just helps freshen it up. Now we're down to the bottom row and pan away. Pan away is a blend and oh yeah smells like a wintergreen mint. It helps also with inflammation and pain. I put this on the bottom of my husband's feet the other night before bed with a carrier. He has plantar fasciitis, fasciitis? I don't know how to say it. Anyways, he woke up the next morning and said they felt a lot better. So there's that. Next is RC. RC, let's see my notes. Oh yeah, RC is supposed to be good for respiratory issues. And what does this smell like? Oh yeah, this smells like something, but I can't figure it out, don't love it. Ugh. So if you guys know what this reminds you of, please leave it in the comments. I don't hate it, but i like not a fan of this smell, but I can't figure out what it reminds me of. But again, this is supposed to help like if you have a uh, scratchy throat or something like that. Purification, another blend, and it has a really light aroma and fresh. I like it, it's very, very subtle. So people diffuse this to help freshen up a room. If you cooked with fish or something like that, you might wanna diffuse this in your kitchen. And it doesn't, it's not, uh, it's not a strong scent, so it's not gonna mask the smell, it's gonna actually take care of it. Frankincense. I was most excited to receive frankincense. I've been wanting this oil for a really long time. I like how it smells a lot. So frankincense is anti-aging, so you can apply it to your face. It was used, uh, you know, in the biblical times to uh, stop the body from decomposing. So I don't know how much more anti-aging it can be. And it's good for women's issues, their time of the month, which I could use help with. And it, uh, people use it for prayer and meditation. I, if you're new to me, I've been trying to up my meditation practice. So I've been just putting a drop on the inside of my wrists, rubbing them together, and then smelling before I meditate. And if nothing else, it's just part of a ritual to get my mind into meditation mode and so I have this in the basement where I meditate and I've been using it every morning. Lastly is lavender. I mentioned my favorite. If you only get one oil, you get lavender, but you're gonna like it so much that you're gonna get all the oils. It's kind of like the gateway drug oil. Lavender is very calming. I have anxiety, so it's very calming to me. I diffuse it in my necklace a lot, especially in the spring and summer. I diffuse it. I make my own bed linen tonic with lavender and some rubbing alcohol that I'll put on our bed before we sleep to get us in that calm mode. I also apply it to my face maybe once a week. It's just, you can do so many things with lavender. And I have to say, Young Living's Lavender is special. It is really special. Okay. Woo! So those are the 10 oils that come in this box. But then, so this is what it looks like. This is a little trap door. Ah! Uh, okay. So there are some goodies 
down here. First, I don't know how to say this, Ninja. You know, I think Sarah, I have like a sneaking suspicion she's gonna talk about this in her video. I saw on her Insta stories. This is a supplement, it's a sample, it's the Ninja Berry from China. I don't know much about it, but it's supposed to be really good. They give you a whole oil, an extra oil for free. This is Stress Away. I like how it smells. I haven't done much with it yet. You know what this smells like? I was like, what does this smell like? It reminds me of something and I asked my husband, like, what does this smell like? And he said, my grandma's house. And I said, that's it. <laughs> it's very like musty, but in a nice nostalgic way, if that makes sense. I'm excited to use this. Again, I have anxiety, so I have a feeling I'll be using this. Oh, it's called Stress Away. It helps with stress. This is really cool. 10 tiny little bottle samples so you can use this for travel, for your purse, your gym bag. You can make your own blends in this. You can give it away to friends and family, little samples. Super excited about this. It's another cap with a roller ball. You can put this on any of your bottles. I lost my nail again. You can put this on any of your bottles. It's to apply it to your skin more easily. Essential oils should not touch plastic. They also shouldn't get a lot of light, which is why all the bottles are amber. And this ball is metal, which I really like. I've seen a ton of these roller balls sold like on Amazon that are plastic and that does not make sense at all. So I'm really excited about that. Then kind of some giveaway cards if you want to be a rep and sell it. You can give these to friends and family. It explains the benefits and more samples or samples that are packaged up already. It looks like there are about 10 in here. Okay. So along with that kit came this diffuser. I just got the bottom of their line diffuser, but it's really good. If you aren't familiar with diffusers, what you do is you fill it with water up to this line, put your essential oil or oils in there, probably like six drops total, shut it all up, plug it in, and it's gonna vapor out and make your room smell like a magnificent spa and you'll just be on vacation wherever you turn this on. Okay, so that is the kit. It was 160 or 165, worth about $300. I get discounts in the future, I'm in the club, and if I want to, I can sell to others. That's the kit. I did get, I'm almost done by the way, I got just a couple extra stuff. The first is Thieves Laundry Soap. I've used this in the past and love it. This is small. How many ounces is this? Well, I don't know, you can see. There's my head, there's this. But it's 64 loads of laundry. It's extra, extra, extra concentrated. And the reason I love this, I don't like a lot of chemicals in my house, so I've gotten, I've tried a lot of the green laundry products, like a lot, and my husband does not think they clean his work clothes very well. I got this for Christmas, a couple years ago and he thought they it cleaned well and I'm really good with the ingredients so this is like the only thing that we can agree on for our laundry so I wanted to get it again they have a whole thieves line of cleaning products and that thieves essential oil is a big ingredient in here I got vetifer essential oil my son I have a whole series on it. He definitely has anxiety and probably has ADHD. We're in the diagnosis phase and vetifer is supposed to be a really calming oil, really great for anxiety, which I have as well, and ADHD. It's so earthy. And it's a very thick syrupy oil. I'm pretty sure this is distilled from a, like a bark, kind of like a copaiba. Could be wrong. 
it's very syrupy, syrupy. So I think I'm gonna do a blend and put the roller ball on my vetifer. So we'll diffuse this. I bought my son a leather bracelet. I wish I had it. It's a leather bracelet that you can put essential oil on a couple drops, kind of like my necklace, a diffuser jewelry piece. I'm hoping he'll wear it. I'm not sure. Um, but I can give you an update if you wish on how this is going. Okay. They sent me an oil for free that I had no idea. And I could not believe it. I called Sarah. I'm like, oh my gosh. So it's Scarlescence. It's a blend. I have been wanting Clary Sage for a long time. It's on my list. It's expensive. I bet Clary Sage in this bottle would be like $40. It's a really, really high quality oil that's good for women's issues again. I'm having surgery soon for what is probably endometriosis and it's supposed to be really good for, you know, stuff like that. And so I received this blend without knowing I was going to get it. And the first ingredient is clary sage. I think that's so cool. Don't you love when things just happen like that? So I just used this a couple times. I don't, it smells like a hippie, but not like a terrible hippie, you know? That is everything. Thank you so much for staying with me. I hope you enjoyed this. Leave a comment below. What is your go-to essential oil? If you want to win the peppermint oil, details will be listed below. US residents only. I'm sorry, especially to my Canadian friends. I don't understand the international shipping yet. Hopefully someday. But it's going to be open for three weeks. Info will be below. You have to subscribe to this channel. Check out my Instagram if you have Instagram. I think there's a couple more ways to get bonus entries. And I hope you enter. Check out Sarah. She's amazing. Give her some love. And I hope to see you in the next video. Whatever your plans are today, I hope you get them done. Bye, guys. Ooh.